What's going on everybody? It's Thundershot. Welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Fights. This is where you guys uh, can pick the fight that we see here on Dragon Ball Raging Blast 2 as simulated by computers. As you saw, I just went by the screen that says computer intellect and all that stuff. It's CPU versus CPU. I commentate. Bring it to you. You guys pick the fights. It's awesome. Anyways, I've been getting a lot of questions on previous videos on what is this character over here? Not Super Saiyan 3 Broly, the thing next to it. This is that this little slot right here. A lot of people were guesstimating as to what it could be. This is actually an enhanced character's menu. If you play the battle zone in the game, which it, there's a battle zone portion of the game, which as you can see, I haven't played it a lot because I don't care for it. I need to go back. It's all the missing pieces that I have. Battle zone is the only part of this game I have at 100% completed. But you can get enhanced characters, and enhanced characters have certain upgrades and all this stuff. Their power levels are different. They come preset, but they get to a really high power level. You cannot normally achieve through customization, so it's kind of a cool little bonus um, that you can unlock. We can play with some super enhanced characters, but I'm going to leave enhanced characters alone because I don't have them all unlocked. That was just to show you guys what the character is. I get a lot of questions on who that is. Anyways, your first part of the day coming at you is going to be Cyberman, whose name I've been saying wrong. People correct me all the time. I always say it's Shibaman. It's... It, I don't know. I've always called it that. I don't know why. So if I slip up and call it Shibaman, please don't get mad at me. I know it's Cyberman. I just get it wrong sometimes. No Cyberman type. Um, for old Simon, they're both using alternate costumes, by the way. Second one's going to be Cell Jr. This is a highly requested fight. I get a lot. I didn't want to do it because their power levels are so different. Cell Jr. should easily crap on Cyberman. And I still think that that's how it's going to happen. I could put Cell Type on Cell Jr., but I feel like that could almost be an unfair advantage for Cell Jr. He's already got a lot going for him. Uh, so we're going to leave it out. And let's try to pick... Alright, I hate this place, but we don't get to see it very often. We'll do Ruin Planet Namek. I hate this place because it has no bottom at all. Um, and, I, hate, and I, I don't like when you can't knock your opponent to the ground and then charge up key. That's me as a fighter, personally. It just, it offers much less key charge up. But, there we go. Crack of the coke can. Let's do it. Was, as always, for you guys in the Twitch chat, I'll be asking what fight you guys want to see next as soon as this fight's over, so get ready. Ooh, alternate red costume. He's actually cell green. That's really cool. He's actually a tiny little cell. I don't think I've ever seen his alternate costume before. I assumed he'd be black or something, you know. But he looks like, oh, that's, that's adorable. He's just like a baby cell. I mean, he was before, but he was blue, and now he's got the color. Uh, let me talk about why I predict Cell... Oh, let me move the microphone closer to my mouth. Let me talk about why I predict Cell Jr. to win this. Cell Jr. has a... Ooh, good block. Cell Jr. has a much better move base, in my opinion. Um, I don't know. I've fought... I haven't played either of them much, but I fought against both Cybermen and Cell Jr. And it doesn't seem to me like, um, it doesn't seem to me like Cybermen has much of a chance. I feel like Cell Jr. moves quicker. I feel like Cy or Cell Jr. can string moves together better. So I feel like Cybermen's very limited in what he can do, and we might see that uh, coming out. But I feel like Cell Jr. has the better move pool, and I feel like Cell Jr. is quicker. So that's why I feel like Cell Jr. is going to win. Cell Jr., Cell Jr. Anyways, Cell Jr. is up by almost an entire bar of health now. Uh, we'll call it three-fourths of a bar. Um, hate this map. They're getting lost from each other. They literally don't know where each other are at. That's, um, luckily, uh, I didn't put their health up on large. I quit doing that for singles battles, particularly for weaker power level things because it takes them forever to kill each other. Lower power levels drain health quicker. Anyways, high-speed clash. Cyber Cyberman wins it. Snell, yeah, Snell. Cell, snap vanishes away. You'll have to forgive me. I just woke up. I was sleeping. Oh, that's a cool little attack. Just woke up from a nap. I really needed it. We're good now. If it takes me a little bit for my tongue to get warmed up, just give me a second. Simon went for a grab, but they're above each other. None of them can actually hit each other at the angle they're at. Until So Junior snap vanishes twice, gets two hits off, and then goes for a third and starts to string uh, Sidemen around. They actually found one of the few places on this map with land, which is really cool. And they get to charge up a little bit. So Junior had full key, or had one full key bar out of two. Innocent Rush, let's see if it connects. It does, Innocent Rush is a pretty cool move. As you can see, it's just a lot of ass kickery, but there we go. Ends it with a kick to the gut, and then he's gonna knock him away. So Junior's stringing together a really good, uh, really good move pool here. Really good string of attacks. He's now at full power. I forget what his ultimate is, to be completely honest. I know he's already fired off a Super Kamehameha anyway, I don't think that's his ultimate. That's not a bad move either. Sideman has the ability to put acid on someone, which just stuns them. Kamehameha wave to the face. Excuse me, Coat gives me the burps. Anyways, Sideman has the ability to paralyze you, which is a good move in itself. It allowed him to get that other move on Cell Jr. where he grabbed him and slapped him in the head a bunch. But Sideman really needs a comeback. He hasn't even drained Cell Jr. one single bar of health yet. 
Kamehameha Wave, luckily Simon gets out of the way. He's been dodging attacks fairly decently, he just hasn't been putting any moves on Cell Jr. himself. This is what I was talking about in my prediction. Simon just doesn't have the moves that he can dish out uh, at all in comparison to Cell Jr. And it looks, I'm going to go ahead and call it, Cell Jr. is going to not even lose a bar of health this game. It looks like he only needs a couple more attacks to finish him off. High speed, oh, no, not a high speed class, and Cell Jr. wins it. I'm probably going to give you guys another fight this episode. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll get it figured out. But there's your first fight of the day. Twitch chat. Go ahead and tell me what you guys want to see next. And if you're on YouTube, I will see you in a second.